Hey, what's up everybody? It's Harley Lars. Hey, thanks for checking me out. So tonight I'm at Burger Rush. Burger Rush. You see the front of this? It's on Broadway, just west, just, I'm sorry, just east of Hardy. Um, right here in, I guess this is considered Tempe. So, the little face you see behind me, it's my grandson Julian. You've seen me before. You've seen him before. Well, he just flew in today. Very excited. He just landed less than an hour ago. And we're out, he wanted burgers, so here we are, we're at Burger Rush. So this place looks pretty interesting. Uh, on the plus side, everything is cooked with mesquite wood. So it smelled really good inside, it smelled good when we pulled up. Kind of excited about that. Um, I ordered a bacon burger with American cheese and a fried egg on it. Uh, the burgers all come with uh, lettuce, tomato, onions, Thousand Island dressing. The downside that I found so far is everything is cooked well done. So I, I get that they have to protect themselves from uh, diseases and stuff, but I'm not a fan of well done anything, except for my fries. So I also ordered bacon cheddar fries. Oh yeah, oh yeah, right in the belly, right in the belly. Yeah. So I asked for them to well, well done. So we'll see how they are. All right, Julian, you want to say anything, everybody? Um, I'm excited, and make sure you subscribe. That's right. Make sure and you subscribe like. and like and comment and share. And Julian's got his own Fortnite channel, Julian STW, Save the World, Gun Reviews. So uh, there'll be a link to his channel also uh, below in the description. All right? Hey, we'll catch you a little while after lunch. After dinner. Uh, see how excited I am? I don't even remember what we're reading. Oh, and look. So if you look in the window right there, it's my wife and my son, his dad, and his grandma. So, hey, we'll catch you in a little bit. Say bye. bye. All right, you guys, so this came out pretty quick. Look at the size of this burger. Ooh, smells good. Bacon cheeseburger with fried egg on it. Lettuce, tomato. Not bad, a touch dry. You seen this? Oh yeah, bacon cheese fries. This is the side. The order is huge. Bigger than my head. Oh my god, it smells so good. I don't even know where to start. Right there. Hmm. Tastes like liquid cheese they pour over it. Still very good. Look at these chunks of bacon. Mmm. Mmm, this is all skin with a side of sour cream for the fries. So we'll see how everything is once I dig a little further into it. But we're gonna have a special guest for you in one minute. Hello everyone, I'm Julian. You know, you saw me in the intro. So far, the place is good. Like, I like how it's styled Wild West and like country themed. Burger is phenomenal. The fries are real, real fries. And, and what makes it a little twist is that they're using a penguin as a mascot, which I think is pretty cool. I ordered a cheeseburger with just ketchup and cheese and some french fries. And I got a root beer too, too. And yeah, it's a pretty nice restaurant. And I like the name too. Burger Rush. Hey guys, so dinner's all done. So this is my impression of the food. Let's talk to food first. The burger was a little overcooked for my taste. Um, when the toppings come, I thought it was gonna be on the side and you make your own. I didn't realize everything was going to be on the burger. The onions are, are chopped up a little bit. I'm not a fan of onions, uh, raw onions, so my fault for not asking. But um, the burger was a little bit dry. Not bad flavor. Pretty cool thing that it's all done with mesquite. The fries, I asked them to be well done. They weren't really well done. They were kind of just like everybody else's, but pretty decent. Uh, the cheddar cheese tastes almost like that liquid, you know, the. The, the liquid cheese. I don't know what you call it, but uh, 
and then a ton, a ton of bacon on it. You saw it in the picture, in the video. So all in all, I give the burger, burger and fries, probably a, a seven, seven Harleys. Uh, the whole place is pretty cool. A little, little difficult ordering, but all in all, um, pretty cool experience. The, the place is laid out pretty nice. Uh, smells good, very clean. Restroom was clean. Smelled good in there. I don't know. Uh, music was pretty loud in the restroom. Not too bad in the restaurant. Uh, overall, I would give this a solid seven Harleys. All right, now my little cohort that keeps tapping me on the shoulder while I'm trying to talk. <laughs> yes, Julian. Okay, so that was a really good restaurant. I like the burger, I like the fries. My only con concern is like the how there's a bathroom code. That's true. Like imagine you had to like take a giant dump like really <laughs> fast. And then you just have to and then you just have to enter a code. <laughs> like, I pulled my pants. Yeah. Okay. Do you have like no time? <laughs> so <laughs> from an eleven year old mouth. There you go. And I give I give it a uh, eight out of ten Harleys. Oh there you go. So so that was one thing. I guess it I, you know, I don't know the area over here that well. I'm not over here very often, but, you know, it must be uh, people hang out a lot. And uh, so the, the, the restrooms have a door code. You need to go. And it's right on the receipt for you. But if you have to take a giant poo, that's what you're going to do. So, hey, make sure you subscribe. Boom, down over there. Hit the bell to be notified when I post a new video. Like, like the it. video. Comment. What is your favorite burger place in Phoenix? Let's go check it out. Okay, Julian's here for six days. Oh, by the time you see it, he'll already be home. But the next time he comes, we'll check it out. Uh, leave a comment. Subscribe, like, share. Share this with all your friends. Okay? And if you come to the, any of the places in my videos, make sure you tell the owner or the manager that you saw the video on YouTube, Parley Lars, and that's why you came in. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see Parley you next. Lars and Julian Sam, the Little Gun Reviews is signing out. We're out.